If you are not upselling at checkout, you are missing one of the easiest ways to boost your sales. And I'm not talking about post-purchase offers or pop-ups. I'm talking about offers that you can embed within your checkout page before your customers even pay. In this video, I'm going to show you step-by-step -step how you can add a cross-sell to your checkout page using the Monk app. This will help you to increase your average order value without adding any extra friction. Well, with the Monk app, you can set up a lot of upsell and gift offers and they are available for almost all Shopify plans. But this specific feature of adding a cross-sell at the checkout is only available for Shopify Plus users. The good news here is that the same logic that we are going to use to create this cross-sell checkout offer is going to be applicable to create any of their other offers. So let's get started. The first thing we need to do is to install the Monk app on our Shopify store. And in order to do that, you just need to go to the Monk app page and click on install. Once you do that, the app will be installed on your Shopify store and you will be redirected to your Shopify dashboard. Now, once the app is installed on your store, you need to make sure that you have it activated within your published theme. So from your Shopify dashboard, you go in here to online store themes and you click on customize. This is a very important step because if you don't do that, we won't be able to see the offer that you are going to create. And from here, you go in here to the third option, which is app embed, and you make sure that the Monk app is enabled. This is very important again. Once you do that, you click here on save and that's it. There is still one very important step that we need to do in order to make sure that our offer is going to appear on the checkout page. From your theme editor, you go in here to checkout and customer accounts. And in here, we need to add the Monk app cross sell block. So you scroll down in here and you click on add block. And as you can see, you have all of these options. In our case, we are going to go with a cross sell. So we choose it and we go back and we just need to move it to be below this section in here. So I will drag it like this and drop it in here. And all I need to do now is to click on save and that's it. Now let's see how we are going to set up the offer. From your Shopify dashboard, you go to apps and you go to the Monk app. And within the dashboard, you will be able to see all the different available offers. So as you can see, you have so many options to choose from. We are going to go with the second option, which is checkout customizations. So you click in here and you need to choose between gifts and shipping or cross sell. We are going to go with a cross sell option and you click on next. And as you can see in here, there are so many offers that you can choose from and all of them are applicable at the checkout page. I will go with this one, but let's have a quick look on the other offers. So as you can see in here, you have display for cart in a value range, display for items with specific tags. We have also display only for specific customers and display one specific number of items and cart and so on. I will go with this option and click on create offer. And the first thing that you need to do is to name this offer. I'm gonna keep the same name, but for sure it's better to name your offers properly so you can follow up the analytics easily. I will click on next and I will be redirected to the page where I will be creating the offer. And the first thing that we need to choose is the product or products where we want this offer to show. So let's say for example, just if someone added a product A from our store, we want to offer them an upsell at the checkout. This is where we precise this. If this product A doesn't exist on their cart, they won't be seeing the offer. As you can see in here, you have multiple options of how to set up the rule of when to trigger the offer. So I will go with the specific product, but you can play around and check out the other options if you want. And in here, I will choose the product where or products where I want to show the offer. As you can see, I can select a product from here, or I can even do something even nicer and select a specific variant from a product. So if you want to show your offer only to a specific variant, you can also do this. I will go with this one and click on add. Once you do that, you have chosen the rules where this offer or when this offer is going to show. Next in here, you have some additional settings if you want to play around with the scheduling and so on. I'm not gonna touch it and I will click on next. Next, we are going to define the products that we want to show as upsell. And simply you just click in here and you choose the product. So if I choose this one, as you can see, I can add it or I can even add a discount on this upsell. So I will click on add discount and I can choose a percentage or a flat off. I will go with a percentage and 
for example, offer 5% discount, or I can even keep it empty. Now I will click on add a product. And then here I'm adding another upsell. So let's say I'm going to go with a gift card and this time I will actually offer a discount. So let's offer a 20% off. If you click in here, you will see some more advanced settings that you can check if you want to modify your offer even more or make it even better. I'm not gonna go over them, but for sure, take your time like adjusting them, playing around in here, see what you want to change depending on your business and your store. And finally, I will click on next. This final page in here is actually super cool because in here you can change the display of your offer. So you can make it more branded, you can change the font, the colors, how the products are displayed and so on. So you have first the text and you have the options between the different display settings and you can even click on edit display and design and play around in here with the design. So you can change the font, the spacings, the borders, the text style. You can even change the product images if you want to make them bigger or smaller. And you can even change the um, what people see actually on the upsell in terms in here of information. So this you do in here as well and you can add a text if you wish and so on this is actually nice because in this way you can make your cross sell uh, offer on the checkout more branded so it looks more embedded or it looks more naturally embedded with your checkout once you do that you just need to click on save changes and that's it now let's see how the offer is going to look like on the checkout page so this is the demo store that i'm working on and this is one of the products where i have applied the offer i'm going to add it to cart and move directly to the checkout and as you can see the offer is directly displayed in here in the checkout page the page doesn't need to load there is nothing weird or different that happened in here the page loaded and the offer was there and it's actually very intuitive very easy to use you just need like to add the product in here you can even select a variant before adding the product so let me add this product first and as you can see i'm adding it at full price because this is the option or the settings that i have chosen while i was setting up this uh, funnel let me now go with this second product and click also on add and as you can see now this product is added and it has a discount and the price in here is the full price of all the items with the discount and everything is applied correctly so that's it with these easy steps your checkout upsell is ready to make you more money from customers who are already ready to pay the Monk app makes it super easy to set up offers in minutes, whether you are on a Shopify Plus plan or on any other Shopify plan, there are so many offers and options available within this app. I highly recommend you to test them out and see what works best for your business and for your customers. If you want more ideas, I recommend you to watch this video on my YouTube channel where I show you how to set up a free gift with purchase using the Monk app. And by the way, this feature is available for all Shopify plans, so you are going most probably to profit from it. With this feature, you can increase your store conversion rate, increase your sales and your revenues. I will link to this video in here and in the description below, so don't forget to check it out and to watch it next. See you there!